Last Friday, I co-hosted Good Day Atlanta, and I couldn't go to the ATL without meeting my friend, 98-year-old Lorene Harmon. Now, y'all remember Loreen. Loreen has been a guest on our show, but only on Zoom. But I finally got to meet her in person, and it was absolutely amazing. Take a look. So I'm backstage at Fox 5, and I just finished doing Good Day Atlanta, and Loreen Harmon is here. I am so excited to celebrate her birthday with her and just talk to her and get to know her. So she's right beyond me in the room behind you. And I'm excited. Laurie! Oh, hello, family! Hey, family! Oh, I'm so glad to meet you. Oh, oh so beautiful. It's so good oh, to see you. Oh, my goodness. This is the highlight of my life. Well, you are the highlight of my <laughs> life, and you are beautiful. Well, thank you. And oh, you are, too. Thank you. <laughs> this is fun. Let's sit down and have some tea. Okay, thank you. Sounds good. We got any uh, bourbon to put in there? I didn't get any bourbon. <laughs> A lot of times I'm on the internet, and that's why I saw you was on the internet, and you gave me such joy. I said, we gotta bring Lorene on. So how many kids do you have? I have the two sons. Two sons. Ty and one other son, and I have four grandchildren and seven great-grandchildren. What do they call you? Oh, everybody calls me Nanny, honey. Uh -huh. All my uh, children, grandchildren's friends call me Nanny. Yeah. Oh, you know, I'm everyone's Nanny on TikTok, right? Yes, you are. And so I'm everyone's Nanny in real life, too. So I just want to know, you were looking for a sugar daddy. Since you did the Sherry Show, have any sugar daddies called? Anybody got in touch? No. Not I, yet? Not yet. I don't know what the problem is. You know, you know I'm sugar daddies are slow. Oh, is that it? Yeah, oh. they are really slow. Since we haven't found a sugar daddy yet, I wanted to know if we could play this game together. And it's called, Who Would You Rather? The first one is, would you rather George Clooney or Brad Pitt? Definitely George Clooney. OK. Yeah, he is so hot. OK, so now we got, do you know Channing Tatum? Channing Tatum and we got The Rock. Oh, yeah, The Rock. The Rock? Oh, yeah. Who is this? OK, this is Post Malone. And this is Lil Wayne. I don't know either one of them. <laughs> oh my gosh. They need to wash their face. Robert Redford or Clint Eastwood. Oh, well, you know what? I'd have to pick both of those guys, but I can't believe Robert Redford is looking so old. Oh my gosh. I know that we might not have got a good picture of Robert Redford, huh? Well, he's probably getting on up there. He's not a spring chicken anymore. Uh oh. Oh. Steve oh, Harvey yeah. Oh, yeah. or Trevor yeah. Noah? Yeah. Well, you know I'm going to take Steve Harvey. I wouldn't dare take Trevor away from you. That's right, because you know I love me I, from I Trevor Noah. I know, and I wouldn't want to make enemies with my BFF. <laughs> But we love you so much over at Sherry that we wanted to give you something else. We got the surprise. We're going to wheel it in. Look, we got Steve Harvey and your picture on the birthday cake. And the birthday cake was made by K&J Elegant Pastries and Creamery. That is adorable. So we thought because you still like Steve Harvey, we're still on our quest to get Steve Harvey. And we're going to find Steve Harvey. But until then, we got you a great cake so you can eat it with your family. Oh, that's wonderful. Oh. Thank you so much. I just got to give you a hug. You just don't know how this much means to me. It means a lot to me, too, because that's what we want to do at the show is bring bring love and, and bless people to have a good I time. I know. You're such a loving person, and I am, too. I just love everybody that I meet, you know? Yeah. And that's what we need, Sherry, nowadays. We just need more love and, of course, more laughter, too. I love you. Okay, now we're going to drink our tea. I don't have any bourbon. Can somebody get some bourbon? <laughs>